Hi friends and welcome to my channel Civil 3D Pro Designer. We have exercise number 3 for chapter number 15 that how to edit a pressure network using grips in Civil 3D. We will make uh, some adjustment to the layout of the waterline pressure networks along uh, our Jordan coat alignment uh, pipe network and we will use some of the specialized grips to make these adjustment in plan and also in profile view before starting if you are new on my youtube channel please subscribe civil 3d pro designer on youtube to get latest notification about videos open drawing name editing pressure networks using grips once you have uh, this drawing actually you can down, download this drawing from the description in the left view port zoom into the circle mark D1 ok and then click the 90 degree elbow fitting near its center here we have 90 degree circle and then click on its secure grip snap it to the center of circle mark d2 here actually i am going to move my pipe network d1 to d2 so you will see how it will done you can see the fitting moves to the new location along with the ends of the two pipes that are connected to it okay the geometry of fitting looks a bit odd at the moment because the fitting should be changed to 45 degree elbow this will be addressed in the next exercise Now press escape to clear the selection. In the lower right viewport, click the curve pipe between E and F1. Here we have curve pipe between E and F. And then click the triangular grip at circle F1. Here we have triangular grip and snap to the center of circle f2 this one is f2 we can increase pipe like this then click the plus sign grip at circle f2 here we have f2 plus grip you can click and it will show you some elbows which are our standards according to civil 3d and real time on the ribbon here you need to select surface as eg and then cover should be 1.5 meter if you have something else you can put 1.5 meter and ductile iron should be 150 millimeter pipe size and then snap the center of circle G press escape to clear the selection You can see we have add new pipe and fitting from F2 to G. Now click the pipe between E and F2. It's our curved pipe. And then click draw parts in profile. It will ask 
select profile view click one of the grid line of the journal code profile view you will see the water pipe will be appear on this profile view you can see here press escape to clear the selection and you can also select all pipes or i can select right click and then select similar and then go to drop parts in profile again and then upper right viewport just click on profile view you will see we have all points here all pipes here in our profile view now in the profile view click the second fitting from the left second fitting we have from the left here and click the diamond shaped grip if dynamic put input is turned off on your computer turn it on by clicking the icon at the bottom of your screen here just select this diamond shape and you can write any criteria according to your design for example i just put here zero point five five four and it will change little bit down so you can play with these grips according to your design criteria now pan to the right and then you have a, a large pipe just select and you have circle grip in the middle of pipe click on this and move to little bit up and just click over here you can see we have moved our pipe 